time to get serious about movies. Hey guys, welcome to On Cinema at the Cinema, the fun show where we look at the latest movies and the goings on around Hollywood. Uh, we will be visiting premieres and talking to some of the stars and also reviewing the movies using our critical expertise. I'm joined here today by my guest, Mark Prooks, who has been a guest on the show uh, for many years. We always have a lot of fun and we always uh, get into kind of lighthearted debates on whether or not a movie was great or just good. Uh, before we get to the movies, I want to bring out our guest. We actually have a special guest today. He's a guy that's also uh, very relieved at the new direction the show has taken now that we've gotten rid of uh, Tim Heidecker, who, as many of you know, is a black cloud uh, sort of sinking the whole production. Uh, here he is, uh, President Davidson on the Decker uh, Unclassified show, uh, Joe Estevez. Gentlemen, hey, good to see Joe. you. Good to see you, Mark. Hey, good Joe. Good to see you, Greg. Thanks for inviting me, but hey. Guys, kind of bittersweet though. Bittersweet, poor, poor Tim. You know, I just I was up in uh, in Boise and uh, coming down, and I, I was you know going to go to the show, but I had time to to stop off and and uh, see Tim at the Hootska. Why? Know? Look, he he feels worse than anybody about the, you know the. the, the unfortunate with the eighteen people. Nobody mm, feels I think, worse. I think the families feel Their worse. Their families do. Well, yeah, yeah, but you know he's in there. He's not. He's not. He's not uh, happy where he's at. But uh, I bet he's watching more movies in prison than he ever did uh, to <laughs> really uh, on the show. Uh, uh, yeah. Well, <laughs> you know, I, I guess the a lot the, of time the, for uh, that. He's he's talking. He wants to call into the show. I think he said something about how is he going to do call, that? Well, you know, they got phone privileges there, and so I think he can, he can call in. But listen, listen, I want to, I want to show you. Maybe I can, I can give it to you. So. If, you know, if Tim ever does come back, you know you can uh, you can give him. Now these are all from uh, these are all from uh, the great state. Of excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. You should excuse turn me. it off before you come on. I should have. I'm very. Could you hold on a moment, please? Okay. Let's see here. Okay. Hello. 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 Yes. Who's this? Hey, it's Tim. Oh, Tim! Oh, we were just talking about you. Hey, Joe. Hey. Who's there? Uh, well, it's 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 Mark, of course, and and uh, and Greg and myself. Uh, we're on on screen right hey, now. Guys. What? Hey guys. Hey Tim. Tim, you doing okay? Yeah, yeah. Uh, just want to say hi and. <sighs> Uh, just check in and give my love to the On Cinema family and thank everybody for their kind words. Um, you know, I just feel uh, terrible about everything, and um, it's been and it's just the craziest couple weeks. Yeah, well, you know, Tim, listen, we're thinking about you, you know? Yeah, yeah. I miss you guys. What's been okay. you guys doing the show right now? Yeah, oh yeah, we're live right on right on camera here, yes. Uh, Mark, thank you so much for uh, filling in there. And how's the, everything going there? Uh, it's fine. He says it's fine, it's fine. Uh, uh, I got I got Greg I can right hear here. Him, Joe. Say yeah, again? I can hear him. Okay. I can hear him, yeah, you don't have to convey. We uh, do, you're on speaker. I'm sorry. And, um, you know, and, and, and I, I, I got to kind of eat crow here a little bit with Greg and say, you know, doc, you were right about Dr. Sam. And, um, you know, he really put me in a bad spot here. So mm. I want to acknowledge that. And, um, and you brought it upon yourself. If there can be any good news in this situation is so you're gone in general. Uh, I've been talking with my lawyer who's been talking to the DA and there is a path for me um, uh, provided I do certain things and um, which I can't really talk about but uh, looks like I'll be uh, getting, out of the, getting out of here tomorrow oh, on bail. That's and, um, yeah, yeah. So, and also it looks like I'll be able to cut a deal because this is about Dr. San 
and about the, the poison that he made, you know. And I think provided everything goes smoothly, this thing's all going to pass over, uh, for me at least. Tim, Tim, I, listen, I, I think I'm speaking for all of us to, to tell you that that's just just great news. We're, we're just over the moon to hear that news. We're really, really happy that you're coming back. Great, thanks. And I want to uh, thank Greg and I guess um, Mark, or whoever you had. I guess uh, Joe told me you guys did an episode last week. And I want to thank you guys for filling in and keeping the show going. I haven't got a chance to see it yet, but... As soon as I get out tomorrow, I'm going to check it out. And um, what movies are you guys watching this week? Um, uh, Greg? Yeah. Uh, the Circle, um, circle on um, How to Be a Latin Lover. What was the review? What was the rating? Um, we, have, we haven't done it yet. Five bags of popcorn. Five bags. <laughs> And, uh, again, for this oh, hey, uh, uh, I'm just tickled to death you're coming back, Tim. Wow. Okay. I'll talk to you later. Okay. Bye. Gotta go. Safe Bye. travels. Bye-bye. Bye. <clears throat> Listen, anyway. <laughs> I uh, <clears throat> I brought you guys some uh, li little, uh, little souvenirs back from Boise. Okay, now, uh, number one. Idaho Spud, Idaho Spud. Uh, I, now, listen, that was for Tim, but if you eat that, I won't tell, okay? <laughs> okay. Now, here is, uh, you know, you're wondering, you're always looking for that bottle opener. There it is with the Idaho Spuds on it. And uh, did, you know, didn't forget about you, Idaho with the Spuds on it. And, uh, okay, I really love these, okay? Idaho, Idaho, on one end, you know, you got, uh, uh, how's that work? You got the, the flashlight, see that? And the other end, you got the pin. All right. And the last but not least, what do you get in Idaho? Potatoes. Potatoes. <laughs> potatoes. Potatoes. I got a great story about those uh, potatoes if you, if you got a minute to listen. Okay, see, I actually, because these are Idaho potatoes, but I was coming directly from the set in uh, uh, Boise to here, so I bought the Idaho potatoes at Ralph's before I, I left, you know? And I was gonna leave in the car because I was getting off the plane directly to the set. And I forgot, I took them on a plane. And I'm putting my luggage away, and that stewardess says, okay, now we're going to Boise. If anybody has got a potato in their luggage, I will give the whole row free drinks the rest of the trip. I'm like jumping up like a little schoolgirl and let's make a deal, you know? I, say, I, got, I got two potatoes! I got two potatoes! All the planes look at me like I'm some kind of weirdo, you know what I mean? <laughs> you know, I don't even drink, but I'm going crazy, you know? She said, you do not. I brought them out, she held them up in front of the whole plane. There, I was uh, traveling with Larry Thomas, you know, the guy from the Soup Nazi guy, you know, from Steinfeld. Whole plane went wild, it's crazy. Yeah, so Boise was nice, Boise was nice. Snow up there. No, okay. Thanks for tuning in to our...